Welcome back everyone. So Rockstar announcement has finally arrived. Rockstar have launched the trailer and what I can say is potentially the biggest disappointment Rockstar has ever released. From all the hype around a remake and next gen for releases for Red Dead Redemption, the only question I have to ask is, did we ever expect anything else? On August 17th, Red Dead Redemption and Undead Nightmare will arrive on Nintendo Switch and all modern platforms for PlayStation. And by that, I mean PlayStation 4. This is a report and there will be no major graphic overhauls. It will be clearer and more refined. There will not be 60 FPS. Quite simply, I'm literally speechless. From all the speculation, from the hype to Mexico, from remake to graphic overhauls, to Reddit Online inclusion, to next gen, this is potentially the worst possible outcome Rockstar could ever have delivered. This is the biggest disappointment, and I feel that Rockstar have surpassed themselves from the previous bad decisions made within the GTA trilogy. From all the new videos I've released recently, and the polls, and the hype just from the Red Dead community was insane. Everyone was hyped for a new addition to the Red Dead collection. But instead, we're left with empty hands and broken hearts once again by Rockstar. My honest reaction to this is quite simply complete and utter disappointment. There are so many questions rolling around right now. I will cover this in another video, but this is an initial reaction to the release from Rockstar. We will cover what is happening in the new release and give further information for the Nintendo Switch guys and also for the place PS4s. At the minute, it's just an initial reaction. One of my main questions I have from Rockstar is, if Red Dead Redemption 1 was cancelled last year due to feedback from the GTA trilogy and the Red Dead Online team was moved over to support the development of the new Red Dead game, what on earth have they been working on? This is quite simply a port from Red Dead Redemption, Xbox to PS4 and Nintendo Switch. We know the GTA trilogy cut corners, but this Red Dead report has to be the laziest report ever created. Honestly, who wants to play it on PS4 now or would want to play it on Switch? I have no idea. Digging into what's actually releasing, Red Dead Run will now be on the Switch and the PS4, but look at the initial screenshots, it does look clearer. But this is not 100% what should have been delivered. In regards to pricing, the tip will be $50. $50 for a report for the PS4 and Switch. Let that sink in. After all the recent videos, there's always been a strong line throughout the number of the community stating that Rockstar will let us down and that we don't expect anything from them. And throughout this, but it's been a line standing strong and protecting them, saying that Rockstar won't do that. They won't let us down again. They've learned the lesson from GTA. This is quite simply not the case. This project has severely underdelivered. I will cover further details when Rockstar release anything further from the report and the further release. But as you can tell, this is a dark day for the Red Day community. I am pleased that Nintendo will now be able to play it. However, the biggest letdown from Rockstar. Have an amazing day, people, and I'll catch you in the next one.